All right, folks, welcome to StormToby.com and StormToby.com Facebook page. It is, uh, what is today? February 6th, I think. And anyway, there's a blizzard on the way. Winds will pass, winds will gust past 60 miles an hour, easily two, three feet of snow for some spots. This is going to be the biggest storm this year, likely the biggest storm in the past few years. Um, let's take a look at what some of the forecast models are putting out there right now. Here is the very latest GFS model. You can see here it is the low pressure center, 996. We get heavy snow all the way in here, and some of the heaviest snow in western Connecticut. Now the European model has a different idea. The European model thinks the heaviest snow will be a little bit farther east, um, right over eastern portions of New England. Uh, but either way, we just get totally smashed in this area. We're talking easily 20, 30 inches of snow all back in here. In fact, here's my major, latest snowfall accumulations map. Uh, this will probably be updated within the next 24 hours uh, as we begin to figure out exactly how this banding sets up. And it changes a lot if you go from one town to the other. You could have 16 inches in one town, you head over to the next town, there's a lot more heavy snow, even thunder snow, um, and you could have two or three feet because that's the kind of gradient we're going to be seeing. Not just gradient, but, you know, spotty, uh, heavy area of heavier accumulation. Some of the heavy spots would be western Norfolk County, Bristol Plymouth County, and the Merrimack Valley and interior southeastern New Hampshire. Otherwise, a relatively sharp gradient from Philadelphia to New York City. And then once you get into the suburbs of New York, it is at least 6 to 12 inches with a foot or more in most of Connecticut. Also some lake effect snow in um, up, up, well upstate New York. Overall, the capital region about 6 to 12 inches for you guys as well. So for now, have a good day.